Where am I? What, what is this place? What is this bed? I don't know where I am. Oh, look, a door. Let's get out of here. What? What is this thing? Hello? Why am I in here right now? Let me out. I don't hear anything. But whoever put me here left me my hoodie and my phone. Well, I'm going to get out of this gross jumpsuit. All right, let's get out of this. Okay. Get out of it! Get me out of this thing! Okay, we gotta think of an escape plan. Look at this door. As you can see, it's being held together by this rope. That means if I can find the other end of the rope, I can probably pull this up and get out of here. Look at this place, guys. No one uses paper maps anymore. Okay, well, what else do they have here? The window, guys. That's my way out, but it's boarded up. All right. Huh. Look at this. It looks like perfume. Perfume that my grandma would wear, actually. Yep, smells like grandma. All right, let's see what else they got. Can I even get this open? Of course, I can call Chad and V or Daniel on my phone. No service? Are you serious? Is there any Wi-Fi network here? No Wi-Fi? What am I supposed to do? How am I supposed to get out of here? And even if I'm trapped in here, how am I supposed to survive with no Wi-Fi? I'm running out of hope. Everything is either locked or useless in here. Let's just try knocking on the door again. Hello? Get me out of here! Hello? Oh, oh, guys, look, look! It's wiggling. Someone's there. Hello? Who are you? Okay, all right, the note says, please remain calm, lady. Calm? How am I supposed to remain calm if I'm trapped? Sir, hello? Ma'am, whoever you are, grandma? All right, well, I guess I haven't explored everywhere yet let's just keep looking maybe there's more trap doors like last time so we can get out of here so maybe i have to find a key or something <gasps> another note guys another note hello sir i hear him running away again why is he or she not talking to me i don't even know what it says get this handwriting guys you know what they say about bad handwriting? Usually like doctors have bad handwriting because they're writing so fast. So I wonder if this person's a doctor. Okay, well it says if I can try to read it. Solve the puzzle drawer for food. <gasps> Did that note just say food? <gasps> I am so hungry. The prison food was absolutely disgusting and I didn't eat it. I haven't eaten for days. Let's go to the drawer. All right, well, this is the only drawer in here. And this is where I found the compass and look. There are knobs here that twist. And all of these knobs have a white line. There's no clues underneath it. I guess if we just look at the compass, we can find out how to solve this. But wait, in the compass, north usually points up, you know? So maybe I need to try pointing them all up. Yeah, maybe that'll work. Okay, and the last one. North. All right, let's try opening this bad boy up. Three, two. <gasps> it worked, it worked! Oh my gosh, yay! And there's food. I'm so hungry. I hope it's a good snack. Oh my gosh, yes! Maui onion and garlic macadamias. Guys, these are so delicious. All right, let's eat these. Boy, can I trust this food? What if it's a Zorgo member tricking me? And what if the food uh, turns out to be one of their next experiments? Like a B-235 macadamia nut and suddenly I lose control of my memory. But they're so tasty and delicious and I'm so hungry. They're feeding me, so maybe this person is good. One macadamia won't hurt. Mmm, brings back childhood memories. All right, am I still okay? I'm good, but I need it to get out of here. There must be other places in this room that I haven't checked out yet. So we know that this can't open. We just opened this. There's nothing underneath. Nope. Hmm. <gasps> How did I miss this the first time? A briefcase? Oh, just opened. <gasps> What is 
is this? A key! I just found a key. The chest, the chest, this must unlock the chest. All right guys, let's see if this works. Let's go twist in. We unlocked it! One step closer to freedom. All right, let's see what's in here. Here we go. What? What is this? Chess, that's what it is. That's weird, why is there only one piece? Whatever, what else is in here? This box. Oh, it's heavy. Oh my goodness. All right guys, this is left and right and it has little knobby things. I think that means I need to turn them to get this thing open. All right, so let's set up for that. So now I could do, turn these little knobby things. Let's see if this opens something up. Okay, so I need to turn this one left and this one right, okay. It's a lot of coordination. Good thing I have that. Oh. oh my gosh. That just opened. Did this open that? Oh. Let's get out of here. Is this a trap? I know there's someone out there. They were communicating with me. Should I go? Let's check if anyone is there. Super old. But look, there's a front door. We gotta try it out. Come on, let me out of here. Oh, another locked door. Why? What is this? A bell. There's this nice fireplace right here. And oh, it opened. Okay, what's in here? Paper. What? What the heck, guys? Oh gosh, this picture. If you look closely at this little cute little girl, she's wearing a teddy bear on her jacket. And I'm pretty sure this little girl was me. What the heck? Why does this person have a picture of me? I must be a Zorgo member. They've been following me since I was a kid. What? First day of school, it says. That's, um interesting that they have this picture, but I'm just gonna take it because it's mine. Let's just keep exploring, looking for a key or anything. Maybe that's how the person has been writing me notes through this feather pen thing. The game of chess, remember? I found one of the pieces in the chest over there. All right, that's interesting. Someone's coming, someone's coming. Hi, hi. Guys, I heard the door. Is someone coming in? Zorkel member if they're wearing all white. Okay, well he doesn't know I'm here. Let's just pan up to see what he looks like. Why did you keep me in there? Why do you, Why am I in here? Well, I, I can ask you the same thing. But you're the one that put me here, sir. I was just exploring some tunnels. And then I came across you. You were knocked out unconscious. So you saved me. Absolutely. However, only because you might be contaminated. Contaminated? What? Yes, with a virus. A virus? What are you talking about? Let me ask you about your mask, young lady. I know about Protex Zorgo, and those masks are their trademark. How do you know about Project Zorgo? Are you part of Project Zorgo? Oh! Get away from me! Of course not, young lady. 
You're the one with the mask. Okay, well then how do you know about Project Zorgo? What's your affiliation? Well, uh, come here. Okay. Well, it all started when my science experiments became popular. Your science experiments? You're a scientist. Of okay, that's why you have bad handwriting. Uh, precisely. Okay, tell me more. I don't understand. Well, who are you? I'm not telling you. I don't trust you. I'm not part of Project Zorgo anymore, if that's what you're wondering. I'm just wearing the mask to protect my identity. Are you a bad guy? No, of course not. But some would say I am a mad scientist. Okay. Hey, take a seat. I will tell you my story. Okay. Do you trust him? I mean, he did give me food. And he did give me my hoodie back. And he doesn't seem like a big threat. He's just like a kooky old man. I'm gonna listen to his story and see what he has to say. I, young lady, am Joseph Banks the Third. Wait, Joseph Banks? Yes, I'm assuming you've heard of me. Well, I've always heard of you through word of mouth, like Joseph Banks made this, Joseph Banks made that. But I've never seen you before. This is what you look like? Yes, Project Zorgo was always fond of my inventions, yes. my discoveries. This I know. One of my biggest exploits was turning a fully electric Tesla into a DeLorean. You're the one that did that? The only one to have committed such a deed. Well, can you just tell me straight up why are you keeping me in here? If you are subscribed to Project Zorgo on YouTube... I'm not. They release an announcement about a virus! Okay, yeah, I know about this virus, a computer virus. We're trying to get rid of it. Why can't you let me outside to destroy the virus? Hello? Do you remember in the tunnels where I found you? Yes. There was gas and smoke. I thought for sure that was the virus. Are we talking about the same virus here? A biological virus meant to cling to organic life. Wait, so Project Zorgo isn't releasing a computer virus to hack everyone's computer? No, it's a virus for people. Oh my gosh, wait, so am I infected? Fortunately, you are not infected. Okay. However, I think they have spread the virus already. Really? So, okay, I hope the spine ninjas are okay. Wait, did you say spine ninjas? Yes. Okay, I, I said spine ninjas. Explain to me who they are. There's this one tall ninja guy. He has a lot of moves. He can use the nunchucks. And there's this little tiny spy. And she, she's like using binoculars. Sometimes she speaks in different languages. And then there's this other dude who, well, it's kind of weird. Oh, and he hacks sometimes. Well, that's quite interesting. I believe I've worked with some similar characters before. Yes, on the DeLorean. Uh, I don't know how to work those. <laughs> Wait, you've worked with the Spy Ninjas before? Yes, and I've also defeated a hacker with my hands. You've been quite patient thus far. So, would you like some tea? Really? Tea? I love tea. What kind of tea do you got? Earl Grey. Yeah. Precisely. I feel kind of bad because... I actually messed with a lot of this guy's inventions right here. Especially when I was delivering those steel plates of PZ9 and I was taking from the Spy Ninjas. Oh, and there's another time where I actually smashed the crystal. Yeah, and that was actually one of his crystals. I don't know what it's used for, but I smashed it. Sorry. The last thing was, I don't know if you guys remember this, I took off my mask when Chad and V were using the hacker-proof DeLorean to resist the hacker-proofness. Oh, he's back. Hi. What? Huh? Are you the hacker who got past the hacker-proof DeLorean? Um, yes. Oh, well, cheers! You're not mad? 
No, how genius of you to just remove your mask. Thanks. Cheers. <laughs> you didn't even drink it. Remember this? My baby picture? Could that be a Zorgo member in disguise? Let's just, let's question him. See if we can get the truth out of him somehow. Excuse me. Yes, a young lady. All right, mister, I just have a question for you. Who is this? Ah, yes. This is a picture of someone who is very close to me a long, long time ago. What? And I haven't seen her since. Okay. That's mine. No. Uh, okay. What are you doing going through my possessions anyways, you nosy little girl? Make sure to drink your tea while it's still hot. I'm going to go outside one more time and look for some resources. Okay. Don't go anywhere. Um, guys. What the heck? He's lying. There's no way that he knows the person in the picture. He must be delusional because that person is me. I feel like he must be a Zorgo member or something. This doesn't add up in any way. Yeah, let's just figure out how to call Chad and V on this phone. I know I could probably hack it somehow. So all I need to do is get into here so I can connect my phone. Hmm. If I can get something to go in there. Okay, so I checked all this area already. Anything in the, in the bird cage? There's no chess pieces either. I guess we haven't checked the tea cart yet. This? What is this? Okay, there's tea in here. <gasps> what is this? Is this for tea? I don't know what this is for, but I know that this will probably fit into the telephone. All right, let's see if this bad boy works. Oh, definitely fits. Oh my gosh! It opened! I can't believe this worked, guys! I did it! Okay, so I just need to connect my phone in here before Mr. Banks comes back. There's some wires over there, so if I connect them to my phone, I think it's gonna work. All right, so I have V's number on here. I'm gonna connect it to the wires and see if it'll make the call. Connect that, and call. Let's see if it works, guys. I think I hear something. V, V, are you there? I gotta tell you something, V. 